New developments tonight in a tragedy in northwestern Arizona. Five children losing their lives in a fire at a duplex. It's a beyond heartbreaking story, and we're learning the father of most of those kids was actually gone at the time of all things out buying Christmas gifts. This happened in Bullhead City, and ABC 15's Ashley Holden is learning more about these little victims and the tributes now pouring in. Yeah, it's a tragedy. There's there's no other, there's no words that make any of this better. The Bullhead City community and region grieving since Saturday night when five children were killed in a duplex fire. The kids alone in the home, four of them siblings, the other a relative, the oldest 13, the youngest just two. Our community is suffering and the parents and loved ones of those who perished in this fire Saturday night are grieving. The police chief releasing a video Monday on what the community is calling the Anna Circle Fire after the street where the two-story duplex was located. Later, the department providing an update saying the dad of four of the kids told investigators he left for a few hours to buy Christmas presents and groceries. Like you, we want answers too. The cause still under investigation by the Lake Havasu City Fire Department and the ATF, but police say initial information indicates the fire started downstairs, traveling up the only staircase, most likely making it impossible for the children who were all in an upstairs bedroom to get out. It's the shockwave is just is unbelievable. Police telling me the Anna Circle fire is now the deadliest residential fire in the city's history. People like Mike Connor, the CEO and president of the nonprofit River Fund, jumping in to help, starting a fundraiser for the family and speaking with the kid's dad Monday. I'm okay, but he's not okay. And, and uh, let me just put it that way. I mean, my concern was, uh, my, uh, as we are at River Fund, is with what happens now? As Mike helps raise funds, a local funeral home offering to donate their services for all five children. It seems like the whole community is really impacted by this. It's a close-knit family when things of this nature come up. That's why City Councilwoman and founder of Make Bullhead Better, Grace Hecht, is helping organize a vigil on Wednesday. Everyone's connected somehow. Doing this candlelight vigil helps the people in our community that are grieving be able to come together and have a place to grieve together. The names of the children have not been released. Investigators are asking any witnesses who have photos or videos to contact police and speak with detectives. We have the details on the fundraiser and Wednesday's vigil posted with this story on ABC15.com. Katie, just really tragic. Our yeah. hearts are with those families. Absolutely, the whole community there.